in this video we have to design the MOSFET as an amplifier circuit and perform the AC analysis to find out the bandwidth where it is actually acts as an amplifier circuit. So this is the dashboard of the multi-sim software. We perform this experiment using the multi-sim software. Here various components are there and these are the instruments for input and output part. So we require the first of all MOSFET. So this is related on this transistor. Okay. And type here 2N700. This is the MOSFET. Okay. After that, we require the register. So click on this sign register. We require the 1 mega ohm directly type here 1 mega ohm register require the 2 mega then require the 4.7 kilo ohm Lastly, require the one kilo ohm. Then, after that, we require the capacitor. This is three microfarad. After that, we require the plus VCD. So select this one and ground terminal. Okay. So now, after that, we have to design the circuit. Okay. So here, we selected all the components. Now, to make the connection, we can rotate clockwise. Terminal common R2 and R1 and connected to the capacitor. This is connected to the terminal.
connect capacitor C2 to the output speed. After that, we to apply the input signal from the function generator. So, we have the left function generator here. Connect this positive terminal to the capacitor and this corner to the ground. Then, at the output side, we apply the output for connect channel. Set connect channel B and this another terminal is connected to the ground. Yes. Over here. Now here we have to apply the ten volts supply. After that, we to apply the input signal. The frequency 1 kilohertz and the input signal is 10 to 20 milli volt. Okay, close it. Then observe the output waveform on the CR. this circuit okay. over here select here AC because both inputs and outputs are AC select the auto mode So this is the input waveform and this one is the output waveform. Now you can observe here at the channel A the input signal is 16.38 millivolt, but at the output side it is minus 1.33 volt. Okay, so we get the amplified output. Okay. Now this minus sign indicates there is a one interface between the input and the output set. Okay. Now just close it. Let's stop the simulation. Then we have to perform the AC analysis. Okay. So first of all just note down what is the output pin number. This is the five pin number as the output then simulate AC analysis. Here we have to select a start frequency 1 hertz, stop frequency 10 gigahertz, vertical scale logarithmic, and 
then select the output here that is v5 then select it okay so this is the frequency versus magnetic rod after that you need to find out where the particular mosfet acts as a amplifier okay so just find out the bandwidth so how it is find out so first select this cursor cursors are there so what is the value here the constant value here 1.44 magnitude here 1.44 Find out the bandwidth. We require it's seventy percent. So just multiply this one point four four with zero point seven zero. So consider the magnitude one. Okay. And select this cursor at one. This y1 and y2 indicates the magnitude value. So that is 70% of this output, and this is the x2, which indicates the upper cut off frequency, and this is the lower cut off frequency. Again, the bandwidth of this particular MOSFET is just just um, Five eight seven point thirty five kilohertz minus two five five. Okay, so the bandwidth of this MOSFET as amplifier is five eighty seven point zero ninety five. done the simulation of this MOSFET as an amplifier circuit.